a day, every day, it would take you almost 3,000 years to get to one trillion. Four years in a row, we've had trillion plus dollar deficits. We now have a $16 trillion debt. Now we're paying more than $600 million a day in interest on that debt. We deficit spend in excess of $3 billion a day. Money that we don't have, that we have to, we have to go out and borrow. This is not sustainable. What it requires is some adult leadership that is able to put together a budget and put us on a trajectory to actually meet the needs of the nation. Now, I believe there is a proper role of government, but we have to debate and discuss that. The way the framers set up their constitution is we have a House, we have a Senate, we have a presidency. But when you have two of those people that aren't engaged in the process, it falls down and it breaks apart. I can look everybody in the eye and say, look, for the last two years, Paul Ryan is the budget chairman. We have produced a budget and, and passed a budget. Yet the United States Senate has gone more than 1,200 days in not producing a budget. And when you look to President Obama, he will look you in the eye and look right in the camera as he did in the television commercial and say that he wants to pay down the debt. Well, you can't pay down the debt unless you actually produce a balanced budget. Four years running, the president has introduced a budget that never balances. Nobody expects it to balance in year one, but you expect it to balance at some point. Never once did he produce a budget that would actually balance. In fact, one of the consequences is, when it went to the United States Senate, I believe it was two years ago, or last year, it was defeated, I believe, 97 to nothing. The president's budget was voted on this, this year, it was defeated 99 to nothing. How bad is your budget if, if Chuck Schumer won't even vote for it? There is not a single Democrat who has ever supported the president's budget. And yet he wants to lean forward. He wants to continue on. We deserve better. We need somebody who understands economics, who understands finance, who understands business. That's why I support Mitt Romney. That's why I support Paul Ryan. They have demonstrated they can be adults in the room and understand the finances of this country and put us on a trajectory to get the, our fiscal house in order. So anytime you hear that word, they want to pay, to pay down the debt or cut the debt, you got to ask yourself when you hear that over the next three days, does anybody have a plan on the Democrat side to actually balance the budget? Because thus far, they've never, ever asked for that. Thank you.